if you notice my eyebrows weird, it's because I already started filming this video and then I realized the lighting was so bad that I couldn't live with myself if I stayed there. So I moved and started over. I'll talk to you about what's on the agenda while I do this eyebrow. We're going for 1920s makeup because I've been obsessed with the 1920s recently. I'm Gat. Really just the architecture, not like the 1920s as a whole, but I can't build a building. So we're going for the makeup instead. And I don't really know a lot about 1920s makeup. We're just kind of winging it. I looked at some pictures on Pinterest though. This glue is so flaky. Like the second it dries, it starts flaking off. What's up with that? Maybe it's because it's like nine years old, but like, it's not my fault it's nine years old. Why is it doing that to me? I've only ever glued my eyebrows down one other time for a makeup look. And if I'm remembering right, it completely ripped my eyebrows out. Hopefully that doesn't happen again, but if it does, it'll at least be funny. Oh, I was supposed to powder them. We're already off to a really rough start. Ew, dude, they're chunky. They're so chunky and I'm swiping. I shouldn't be swiping. Ew, ew, ew. I have to lay my eyebrows down. That's what the girlies in the 1920s did. But also this looks foul. I don't know if I can do this. Are you seeing what I'm seeing right now? That looks so nasty. I have to start my eyebrows over it. I'll be right back. A wipe, my lady. Thank you. Yeah, it did come off. I didn't lose a singular eyebrow here. Let's try that again. <laughs> I'm not gonna brush it through. Nothing's happening. This is it. This is all we're working with. This is gonna go much better. I can already feel it. We're doing great, you guys. Good job, team. Why is my left hand moving faster than my right one? I feel like they should be moving in unison, but I feel like my left one's speeding up a little bit more. I think they're done. Like I have Botox, probably. I don't know what Botox feels like, but I can assume it feels like this. I'm gonna powder him this time. I'm not skipping that step, given it was an accident. It wasn't my fault. Let's powder the life out of them. They won't stand a chance. I'm gonna consider that good. I think we're ready. That was so time consuming. And for what? Wet and wild photo focus. This stuff is like magic. Oh my God. Why does it still look like that? I'm about five seconds from shaving my eyebrows off. <laughs> You're really lucky I'm not using the better quality camera. You would not want to continue watching if you could see actually what's going on. Is this gonna help or is this just gonna make things worse? I have a feeling the latter, probably. Do I look like Jeffree Star? I mentioned to you guys that I wanted to perm my hair. I got a lot of comments being like, don't do that. It will melt your hair off. And I was like, mm -mm. I ordered a perming solution that's good for bleached hair. Turns out I was wrong. I looked at the fine print when it came in and it says don't use it on bleached hair. I wasn't prepared for any situation where the box could come in and could say that it wasn't made for bleached hair. I don't have a backup plan. That was my plan to get this box of stuff in that was good for bleached hair. That looks crazy. So I might just have to wait till my hair grows out, which isn't necessarily what I wanted, but I can tell you what I want less and it's to be bald. So I mentioned being bald in every single video I put out. If anybody were to ever decide they wanna to put together a compilation, me not wanting to go bald could be a really easy one. From a lot of the pictures that I saw, it was like the classic flapper makeup with like the darker shadow in here and their eyes are kind of downturned. That's what we're going for. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to keep that in mind the whole time, because usually I start veering off in my own direction, forgetting what I'm doing, but maybe me saying it out loud will help me remember. Sorry, I gotta be silent. Ew, I really don't like how that made me look. Hopefully it looks up from here because I'm not liking that. I'm giving myself a downturned wing, which might make me look so much worse than I already do. I've tried downturned wings on myself before and it makes me look like those eggs from Alice in Wonderland. Have I been looking at myself too long or is it kind of cute? Am I lying to myself? I don't think it's that bad. Anyway, I also feel like they have kind of like a shadow under their eyes. So I'm gonna add a slightly lighter color there. I'm putting white eyeliner on my waterline and attempt to look like I'm about to start bawling at any minute because they always look like that. Do I look like I'm about to cry the biggest cry that's ever been cried? I feel like I don't look like myself. I'm kind of grossing myself out right now. I'm gonna use eyeliner to try to make sad looking eyebrows. This could be the downfall of us all. Really, it could just start a dumpster fire. And I'm scared of that because I don't wanna redo my eyebrows. So let's hope 
for the best. If I look like I'm about to start crying, it's not the makeup. It's actually because these lights are singeing my corneas out of my skull. Getting these symmetrical might be a challenge. You know what? It's not that bad. I think that these need to be a little bit more dramatic though. I feel like in the pictures that I saw, the women looked sad. I don't really look sad. I look like I have some sort of problem, but I wouldn't say it's sadness. I'm gonna try to give myself the like extraordinarily rounded lips. I outlined where I want the red to go with this more natural color. That way, hopefully it'll help me not mess up. I'm gonna go over that with this dark red. I wonder if their makeup was actually good back then or if everybody was just running around looking like Barnum and Bailey's just got out. <laughs> if you know anybody that was conscious in the 1920s, can you ask them and relay that information to me? Because I actually want to know. Can I Google that? I could probably Google that, huh? Whoa, that's too much. <laughs> we need to take it down a notch. I wonder how much makeup I eat on a yearly basis. Not intentionally, I don't just like eat makeup, but like, you know. I know the flapper girls went pretty hard with blush, but I don't own blush. So I'm just gonna use this color. I'm using a tiny brush because my other brush, that looks dumb. <sighs> Something about this does not look right. It's not part of their makeup, but I'm gonna contour my nose a little cause I feel like my nose looks really, really basic compared to the rest of my face. Something strange. I'm just gonna use these little crusty Ardell wispy lashes because that's kind of all I've got. I'm gonna try to get the outer corner a little downturned. Okay, we're getting somewhere. I need bottom eyelashes and I would draw them on, but I honestly feel like my natural bottom lashes will be okay. So we're gonna test that out. I might have the craziest natural bottom eyelashes in all of North America. Call Guinness. He needs to see this. <laughs> Should I give myself a beauty mark? I think I failed to inform you that I was getting up to go look up what flappers wear, but I did that and here we are. How's it looking? I look crazy in the bathroom mirror, like worse than I've ever looked at any other point of my life. Can you see that this light is destroying my eyes? It burns so bad. I would wish this on my worst enemy. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm wearing a necklace on my head. Yep. <laughs> I saw that a lot of flappers wore things on their head, but my head's just too big to put it around this way. So I put it on like a headband and you can mind your business. I think I'm done. Do I look like a cute little flapper or do I look like that lady from Shrek? Tell me what you think. But if you're gonna be mean about it, don't tell me what you think. But also, why would you be mean about it? It looks incredible. Unless I edit this and I realize that I look just as bad on camera as I did in the bathroom mirror then. I guess that's it, we're done. You can go home now, it's over. I hope you had a good time. I had a good time. I wasn't lying, I don't know why I started avoiding eye contact. I will see you next week. Bye. I am sweating like a sinner in church. I have to turn my AC off in order to film these or else you're gonna hear the AC blasting off in the background like it's a test run for SpaceX.